Okay, Paul, now we got the best swimmer in the 24 wins division Divas in the league. That's right, Sandra gets ball for Racing Seven will be taking on Penny Days, the daughter of the Days Brothers, at least a mile ago. After Sasha paid off her swimming ability in a fall pretty show in our last edition, let's see if she can do it again with Sandra and Groove to 2-0. We run to the next three team months on the quest of victory, and we start the runs! Okay, so will Sandra gets ball pay off her swimming ability once again? Or will Penny only so think our way to stop her from her incredible swing ability? Sergeant Gisborne is one of the top contenders for the 2020 Mission Championship title this season. And right now in the three viewers of the Chief of Palm Trees, and now in the Rainy Field, and there will Penny vs. MRI, and Sasha and Lisa are dancing in the meet. So, Penny Days is going to have the upper hand for a while. And who will get the first beat of his base? It's number one! That's who, and right now number six is going west. That means we'll drop down to last place over the eight shell and the curve wound. Now we're not mad since number six has a lot of catching up to do anyway. Right? As Beavers number two of this exciting race will be made by none other than number eight. Who is battling with numbers one, ten, four, fifth place over at the bridges. And right now, Sasha gets bow is one of us along with number two. That means Payton Day is riding the privilege to battle with Sasha gets bow for the lead up in the front. And right now, we smell go not too far behind in third place as they make their way towards the top of the wall. And right now, it is number seven who will get the next command. Yes, and we are approaching a one minute mark in this race. Right now, it is number six who is still left behind in the competition all the way in the back. He is trying desperately to catch up with the Emerson Channel of the crowd. And it looks like number one will get the number two. That makes his second speed bus in the race. And Lisa Malgo is going to So he'll move up a couple places. Meanwhile, Sandra gets bone now has a commanding lead over Penny Days, who's trying to catch up to her in a hurry. And we got the next one. It's number six. He finally gets the turn. Now trying to catch up to number one for DUI. And number one talks from one. So he will join number six and eight for DUI. Looks like Lisa Malgo might not have enough distance to make a miracle comeback from either Sandra gets bone. Or paydays. Well, she's going to have the next command for us. But I think there's always the next time. Sasha gets ball and Penny Days are making their way to us some wall. And now they're rushing past the waterfall. Sasha gets ball with that close to the body. Should put, pull this one away for Penny Days. More telling. And we'll do that more telling. Right now, next for us belongs to number seven. He wakes up but snap not immediately. And numbers one and eight are going to mess. And now number six is going to mess. So these three shall be left behind in the competition. And as Lisa Malgo takes her second speed bus, Sandra gets ball, pulls this one away from Penny Day. And the club is going to be paid off, and now she's at 2 and 0 in her 2019 2020 Chow Raising Wins Division season. Well done by Sandra gets ball. As number six will get her second speed bus on the race. And that is going to do it. Penny Days will come in second place, and that will be far by Lisa Malgo in third place. So just ahead on numbers two and seven. And that's going to do it. So, Sasha gets ball now sits at 2-0. That's right, that's two wins in a row for Sasha gets ball. Pretty good chance to show make wins with your championship. Back for the final race of week 14 of the Needs Messengers.